The East Coast Road, which connects Chennai with Pondicherry, is one of our favorite stretches. With a great view of the ocean, sparse traffic and smooth tarmac, it is an instant mood lifter. Last month, we found ourselves on this very road yet again. This time, though, apart from submitting ourselves to the pleasures of the open road, we were also checking out Apollo's Amperion, one of the country's first ever tires specifically made for electric vehicles. So, yes, it goes without saying that we were in an EV ourselves, and a formidable one at that, the Tata Nexon EV Max, shod with Apollo Amperion. Hold on, why would EVs need tires specially made for them, and how are they different from regular tires? Electric vehicles offer a bunch of many obvious benefits, but there is also another side to the picture, especially in the context of tires. EVs are significantly heavier than ICE vehicles, due primarily to the weight of the battery packs, and that instantaneous torque, which enthusiasts keep raving about, leads to higher tire wear. While EV tires might look similar to tires used by ICE vehicles, they are markedly different when it comes to tire design, components used in construction. The Apollo Amperion, for instance, uses the latest generation polymers, traction resin, and other raw materials. And, to manage the instant acceleration of EVs, the Amperion also has an improved tread pattern and rubber compounds. The Amperion range, available in 195mm and 215mm tread sizes, in both our 16 and our 17 rim profiles, utilizes high traction, full silica rubber for its tread compound. The Empyrean, whose design takes inspiration from jellyfish, is considered to be among the most energy-efficient and silent creatures, also exhibits lesser rolling resistance, amounting to around 30%. This consequently improves the performance of the EV and extends its battery range. Apollo calls the ultra-low rolling resistance technology package best tech, battery energy saver technology. Another attribute that helps the Empyrean achieve reduced resistance on the road is its recessed profile, which helps lower aerodynamic drag. The Amperion is not just among the first EV-specific tires to be launched in India, it is also the first EV range of tires to receive a 5-star rating for all the released sizes by the Bureau of Energy Efficiency. Electric vehicles such as the Tata Nexon offer quiet, relaxing drives, and tires such as the Amperion improve on the experience. The Amperion is equipped with HUT Tech, Apollo Quiet Tire Technology, which works on tire cavity, tread pattern and construction to reduce noise. The tread pattern on the Amperion is stiffer and has a larger footprint with multiple pitch sequences to achieve the desired requirements of low noise, besides helping achieve low rolling resistance and high traction. In ICE vehicles, tire noise is subsumed by the roar of the engine, but in an EV, the former is very noticeable and Apollo has done a commendable job in elevating the serenity inside EVs. But the trick up the Amperion's sleeve is not restricted to just low noise, according to Apollo, Amperion tires are capable of enhancing the range of EVs by up to 8%. Which is, of course, what got us curious in the first place and led to this drive we are on. To cut a long, pleasant story short, the Amperian tires made the ECR drive a memorable experience. Our plan was to head to Pondicherry and back on a single charge and then tally the figures with our previous tests with the Nexon EV Max. The Nexon EV Max had achieved 263 kilometers back in June. We stuck to city and eco modes during our run, and after a quick lunch in Pondicherry, we headed back up the ECR, keeping an eye on the Odo all the time. The final numbers were pretty impressive. The Nexon EV Max achieved a range of 280 km, which was about 5% more than our previous real-world test figure of 263 km. Clearly, it pays to think differently when it comes to EV tires, and Apollo has shown it also pays dividends. The Apollo Amperian tires are specifically designed for electric vehicles, which have different performance requirements than regular ICE vehicles. EV tires have to meet specific expectations that have to do with range, traction, as well as robustness and durability because of the difference in weight between an EV and ICE vehicle. The biggest expectation is the battery range. The tires have been designed with best-in-class rolling resistance specifically for EV vehicles and customers can expect the tires to extend the battery range by a minimum of 5%. We have also taken into account the extra traction requirement, as the motor torque is quite high in EVs, and also the fact that they weigh more than ICE vehicles. So, it helps EVs brake at the right distance, ensuring that regenerative braking also comes into play seamlessly. The tire's load-bearing capabilities are also top-notch and we have designed them keeping Indian conditions in mind. We're using a specific technology of full silica tread to ensure that we get the right traction and right rolling resistance. Apart from the full silica tread, we also use fourth-generation polymer technology and functionalized resins, which impart high traction to the tire, apart from other properties. So, this is the key difference in this style. Coming right back to the construction, we also reinforced the tire for Indian road conditions and to ensure the desired traction and handling are provided. When we designed the Amperion, we worked a lot on getting the materials technology and design bang on. The design of the cavity of the tire helps it deliver much better aerodynamic drag force. And that helps in reducing the overall rolling resistance. 